What's up everyone and welcome to Ola Learns, the video series where I take a song, I learn it, and that's it. The point of this series is basically just to showcase how I would go about learning a specific song or a specific solo. Maybe it can teach you a thing or two or maybe it's an absolute complete waste of time. I haven't done one of these in a while now and I'm extremely excited because today I'm gonna learn a Slayer song. Yes, and people will probably expect that I would learn like uh, Rain and Blood or uh, you know Angel of Death or something like that or Disciple like the classics maybe for another time but for this video I wanted to kind of make a tribute to the album that got me into Slayer and that album was Divine Intervention and that's kind of like an in-between album a little bit not too many people are talking about that album but it is one of my favorite Slayer albums out there it had so many really good songs on it however the production leaves a little bit to be desired but I just recently learned that they actually recorded the full album in three different studios and they were trying to match the sound in between the different studios that sounds like a complete nightmare today's song I'm gonna learn is called Fiction Reality and it's actually one of my favorite riffs of all time it's such a spidery type of riff I mean listen to this oof the oh my god it might not necessarily be a traditional thrashy slayer song but it's a killer song nonetheless for the occasion i'm bringing out obviously the bc rich this is the bc rich warlock pro uh from uh what was it was it 90s uh i don't remember exactly when but it's it, i have a video of this guitar you can go check it out it's actually quite interesting I got it loaded with the Gary Holt signature set right here, EMGs baby. I'm just ready to go. And pink, pink is the color of Slayer, right? So the trick to figure out some of these riffs is that uh, I have this uh, speed or vary speed so I can basically slow down the song in Logic. And that's a great technique of listening in on the riffs, holding in on the notes and uh, getting it as accurate as can be. And this song is tuned to E flat. And this guitar does not hold tuning very well. But that's not gonna stop me from learning Slayer today. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, let's go. This first riff, man. And the thing is, I've, I've uh, started learning this riff a long time ago uh, because I thought it was so cool. But it's such a spidery type of riff. You know the spider lick that people used to practice? <laughs> And all that it's th this is basically like a picking exercise listen to this <laughs> it's so freaking insane man 30 percent slower and i remember it to start off uh with something like this which is weird because that's uh, very uh that sounds almost major Let's slow it down even more. 50% maybe. Yep. Okay. Okay, we got this. No. Okay, he's going down. Okay, classic layer. Oh. Dude, shit like this messes with my head a lot, man. I mean... Okay, I think that's it, though. But even at, you know, minus 50%, it's still so fast. That's the best finger right there. Go from uh, pinky to second finger to uh, ring finger to point finger. So. 
if you want to get the speed in. That literally hurts my brain. If anything, this is just real good for your coordination skills. Ah. Hey! Hey! Dude. You can probably see my brain working. Like, literally working. Right there. And then it's gone. Fuck. <laughs> you know, I think it's like this. Even if I don't play it right, it will probably sound right. Because, you know, I'm just a... It's just the picking, you know, the, the exactness that's important. Okay, I can probably get away with this. <laughs> you, let's just go to the next trip. <laughs> Okay. Is that it? Yes. You can instantly hear when they're doing chromatics, so that's easy to figure out. I think that's it. Okay. It's really hard to hear, but... Solo time, hello! Oh shit, spot on! So. Okay, so we have <laughs> something like that. Is that it? I think that's it. You can always trust the chromatics. Okay, best part. Listen to this. Okay. So, probably... Or a guitar pick. You can type with a guitar pick too, so get a little bit more edge to it. Right? <laughs> oh, the ghosts, man. Yes.
<laughs> All right, middle me solos. That's the good thing about Slayer. There's a bunch of middle me's and a lot of uh, you know uh, wang bar. So. <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna wing that last thing. I have to go back and uh, practice the first part, man. That's what that's what's gonna be a problem for me. All right, so I've been standing practicing this little spider riff now for a while. I'm gonna try the song now. That's a workout, man. This is a break. Out of tune. <laughs> Holy shit, I pulled through. Sort of. I just realized something. The absolute tough spider riff is only happening at the absolute intro of the song. It never comes back. Which is a little bit weird. <laughs> That's the best riff. The first half of the song is also an incredible uh, workout for your right hand. Just saying. That's, uh, that I felt that. That was a burn. Classic old mistake. I didn't have the screen capture on the computer. So you couldn't see anything of what I was doing. Uh, but you can hear at least, so that's something. But basically this is Logic Pro X. And here's the uh, uh, speed down uh, thing that I have. So I can speed down the song and analyze the track basically. But it's really, like at minus 50%, it's really tough to hear. 
you know? That's close enough, man. Uh, I'll be able to play this and completely forget this song tomorrow. <laughs> That's just how it goes in my brain, man. But that, it's a lot of fun. Holy shit, what a good song. If you like this type of segment, let me know in the comment section. And also, because this video is going to get demonetized by me obviously playing another, you know, person's music, maybe you can consider subscribing to my channel to support or get something from oldanglandshop.com or something like that. Uh, thank you so much for the support. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Leave a comment in the comment section uh, of a song you want to see me learn next. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.